financial freedom mindset. What's up, my people? Today I'm talking about a quote that I heard on Friday called, You win some, you lose some, but you get to live to see another day. And that helps me out sometimes. When I take losses with finances, sometimes I, I take a big loss trying to do a new venture. And it's horrible, yes. And sometimes I get discouraged, yes. But to humble myself and put stuff in the right perspective, what I do is think about I'm very blessed. Some people aren't even allowed to take the ventures and the chances that I take. They're not in that financial situation. Some people are in the hospital and very sick, and they wish that they was out here to just have just um, just to be healthy. And certain things that we take for granted, or I take for granted. I want to say we, because I'm not going to say you. I take for granted, and then I have to really think when I really get discouraged and be like, man, I'm always trying. I'm doing what I'm thinking I'm supposed to do. I'm working hard. I'm sacrificing. I want to make a life better for my kids, yada, yada, yada. I'm telling this to myself, and then I get discouraged, but then I understand that, man, you know what? It can be worse. You don't have it that bad, Troy. It can be worse. Some people, not they can't even wake. They don't wake up in the morning, or they're going through... Uh, tremendous pain and they're in the hospital and they they just wishing for health so when I hear that quote or when I heard it it really stood out to me it's like man you win some you lose some just like with me invent, um, with ventures investment ventures I win some then I lose some but even when I lose I have to look at it and say man I, I get to live to see another day I get to wake up tomorrow I get to go to work I get to earn the money again and I get another chance to invest again, to even get the opportunity to, to, to be on the path to financial freedom. Some people don't even get that. Some people don't wake up in the morning, and if they do wake up in the morning, some people in extravagant pain, some people in different countries, and they don't even have the access to money or finances like we have access to finances. So this really helped put the in perspective for me, because sometimes I do feel like giving up, and people are always like, hey man, how you stay so positive? And then I hit them with that, like, man, it could be worse. Let's say I had a thousand dollars. I'm just using it for example. Let I had a thousand dollars, and I lost a thousand dollars, but I can go to work and earn a thousand dollars again to try another venture. Then I, I got another week and another month that I could continue to earn and earn and earn. Then I could open. I could go online right now and open up a business in sunbiz.com. Anybody can. Not just me. Anybody. Who live in America and in Florida. I don't know about other states. Other states is a different website. But in Florida, you can go on Sunbiz. You can open up a business right now. Just going on there with your ID and the government send you an EIN number. There you go. You got a business. In other countries, it don't work like that. You probably have to climb through hoops to get in order to get a business um, a business license and I, uh, uh, EIN number and certain things like that. So I have to really... For me, put in perspective, and that's what keep me going. To say, hey man, it can always be worse. You woke up this morning, your family woke up this morning, you got your health. Don't take those things for granted, because a lot of people don't have it. So for me, it helps me. And it makes me don't give up. And at the end of the day, I don't I want better for my family, especially when it comes to finances. I want better for my family. And in order to do it, I have to continue to fight. I have to continue to go. I was watching um, an interview um, and this guy named Dame Dash he's, uh, he used to be with Jay-Z and he was like what if your kids are not as strong as you and I thought about it I'm like man you're right what if my daughter or my son can't take pressure like I can take pressure can't take let down like I can let down they might give up so what I do is I'm going to work extra hard because I don't want them to have to go through that if they must they must but if I can prevent it I'm going to try my best to prevent it so as I make this video on March 13th uh, 2018 um, when they see it and they be like dad I didn't know you was going through that they might see it five years from now my daughter but my son will see it when, when it come out but if I'm here or not here they're like dad um, did you I don't know why I'll be in five years but let's say I'm financially good and I'm happy and I can get everything I wanted and everything they, I can get for them that they need or and want and I'd be like, yeah, Troy, it was at a point in time that dad was, I was working real hard and I got discouraged. But guess what? I kept going. So just to show them in life too, 
whatever you want to do school your own business uh, get a trade um, whatever it is you want to be a bodybuilder you want to be a basketball player football player a singer dancer rapper whatever they decide to do whatever it is you gotta work hard you can't give up you gotta keep going it's gonna be days you're gonna di get discouraged you're gonna put your all into something and it's not gonna go the way that you want it to go but you don't give up you fall down you get back up you get to see another day it's not the worst in the world it can always be worse so just like you know it always can be worse don't stop make that motivate you so anybody who watching this video or who get to hear my voice whatever you're going through understand it could be worse especially when it comes to business because most people who listen to this video is li listening to it for like financial uh, just financial suggestions I'm not a financial advisor just financial suggestions and you're gonna always lose money but I become so numb to it because I always try and I, when you take a lot of shots like I joke with my friend at work when you take a lot of shots like Michael Jordan you can always make mistakes Michael Jordan didn't make all his shots he took so much shots and he missed a lot of shots but he made so many and that's what counted that's what everybody see they don't see how much shots he missed all they see is how much shots he made the same thing in business people don't see how much times you try different things all they see is that one business that took off for you and say oh Troy so and so worked for you and you did this and this and that it, it, that you see that but I done tried 10 or 15 other things before I even got there and I missed and I lost a lot of money but I'm gonna keep going and keep going because I want a better future for my family and I want them to do the same thing so as they get older and this video hang around and they see it and the stuff that I write down they're gonna see it and say don't give up Whatever they're going through, I do not want them to get, give up. Keep fighting. Keep pushing. Don't give up. It's not the end of the world. Whatever it is, it's not the end of the world. Keep going. You lose some, you win some. But you live to see another day. And if you get to live to see another day, you're winning already. Just You got to know that. Can't take it for granted. If, if, if you wake up the next day, you're winning already. Later, my people.